Hey guys, what is up? Sir Lewis here, and I'm bringing you guys this video to show you guys the best settings and best app, in my opinion, to record games on your Android device. Of course, it depends a lot on your device. I have a Galaxy S5, so I can have these uh, really, really good settings. But I'm going to show you guys the settings. There are specific things that you guys want to avoid, and you guys want to have for your settings. So, um, to begin with, this app that I'm going to use is ADV Screen Recorder, and I recommend it because, in my opinion, it has one of the lowest tapping sounds. Um, out of all the other screen recorders, I compared it. And if you guys don't know what the tapping sound is, basically when you guys tap on your screen, it makes it a sound. All screen recorders have this, um, but in my opinion, ADV screen recorder has one of the lowest tapping sounds. So you guys can see it, hear it a little bit. And you guys don't want to have a, a tapping sound because it might interfere with your audio and your gameplay audio. So let's get to the settings um, right here by clicking it. I'm going to have to move my camera. We're going to click these three dots, settings. And let's begin from the top, going to the bottom. Uh, so, first one is preference. It's up to you. Show three second countdown. I have it off, so when I press record, it just starts automatically. And uh, that's up to you. Next one is use hidden button. This hidden button is basically, uh, if you guys hold the top right corner, like I am going to do right here, it basically allows you to choose any color you guys want. Press OK. And then you guys can draw on your screen as you guys can see right here you can you can even draw over the camera which is really cool and then here you guys can press this and it'll go one by one erasing or you guys can just press the x and it'll leave uh, so you guys can have that as up to you next thing is really important um the, the recording engine i recommend the default engine because it's more stable um even though the vance engine supports pausing the default engine is more stable and is has better quality in my opinion so most likely you guys should definitely use the develop engine for now all right so stopping options uh i recommend stopping um by pressing by turning off your phone because uh if you put stop by notification basically you press the top and it stops you guys might do that you guys might be playing a game and you press the notification by mistake and it stops um recording so Try to ju just put a stop on screen off. It's better for you. Uh, next one is really big. It's the video resolution. Obviously, I recommend the 1080p. Of course, it depends a lot on your device. Um, some of you guys might have to do 720p, but try to stick with 1080p or 720p for the best resolution. And the video bit rate, uh, you guys can put automatic, but I recommend 15 MBBS. And just try to stick with 15 or 10 it will basically uh, make your videos have more better quality. Uh, video frame rate, which is really important. Um, when you guys play games on your Android device, a lot of these games are going to be have a lot of movement all over the place. And I recommend 60 FPS. You guys can have 30 if you want. You know, it depends on your device. But 60 FPS is really good. The movement you guys can see right here, it's really, really good. And for these games that you guys are going to be playing, you guys are going to need some really good uh, FPS settings. Um, next one is record audio. Now, I recommend if you guys are just going to record gameplay, turn this off. Um, it'll make the, the audio a lot better. If you guys want to record um, with your audio, your voice, like a commentary, like I'm doing here, leave it on and you guys will record your audio. Um, obviously, to have better audio um, quality, I would recommend you guys to get a clip on a microphone like this. This is probably the um, not the best one, but it's better than just recording from your phone. And you guys just put on the head jack just like you would with the headphones. And, you know, it's better than recording just from your phone. It's uh, um, better than nothing. Uh, so, yeah, right here, you guys uh, you guys can have your camera if you guys want. I have it right here, uh, the face cam. But you guys can have it. Depends on you. Preferences. Um, if you guys want to have a camera a lot. All right. And then here, it's also preferences, logo, and text. Uh, basically, you guys can show your logo like you guys can see right here. That's Sir Lewis BR. This is my Instagram and Twitter. Go follow me, by the way. Uh, and you guys can also have a logo, which is basically a little, a little image if you guys want. Let me see if I have any, you know, I don't have one set yet. But basically, turn it on. You go to press image, and you choose your image that you want to show at the bottom or wherever. So, yeah. And then the last one is really important, too. It's your output folder. Um, I actually have an SD card that has 8 um, gigabytes, so my output folder is the SD card, which is really good because then it doesn't interfere with my internal memory. 
So you guys can have an SD card and put the output folder. You just click it and go to your SD card, fo any folder you guys want, and you guys can um, set it to there. And yeah, guys, these are the best settings to record um, any game on your Android device that you guys play. Uh, you know, it, having these settings are really crucial to having the best quality for your for um, your video. And like I said, ADV Screen Recorder has one of the lowest tapping sounds, which is really important because most of these games that you guys play, like Clash of Clans, Clash Royale, um, these mobile games are going to have a lot of times you guys are going to be tapping a lot consistently on your Android device and you guys want to have a really low tapping noise. Uh, so yeah, I also recommend to tap it really lightly so it doesn't make a really loud tapping noise. So yeah guys, I hope you guys liked the video. Um, please leave a like, comment below if you guys have any questions. You guys know that I always comment back. Um, subscribe if you guys are new. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys in the next one.